Hey Marcus, it's Logan at Perkins Motorplex here in Mayfield, Kentucky. Uh, just giddy, excited to walk around a 2022 Tundra uh, TRD off-road, macked and jacked. So it's the SR5 package with the TRD off-road uh, upgrade. And uh, obviously we've done our own little upgrade with it as well. So uh, yeah, this thing is awesome. Uh, I haven't gotten to spend a whole lot of time with the new Tundras until now. So uh, I guess I owe you a thank you for letting me do this video walk around. So this thing's awesome. Uh, headlights, fog lights, everything straight ahead. This grill looks just awesome. And uh, the hood is great. No hail damage, anything like that. This thing was parked right on the highway right there, facing the highway, so it's caught some of the dust uh, off of the, the vehicles, of course, going by. But um, yeah, this is uh, this is really good. Not a lot of rock pecs or bug damage or anything like that up front. Uh, just looking at the fuel wheels, I mean, everything here is brand new. Uh, brand new lift, brand new wheels, brand new tires. Uh, so no need to really even talk about the shape of those other than they're awesome and brand new. All right, so driver's side, you know, all of our vehicles are used, so we say they all get grace. None of them are going to be perfect. Uh, so I'm sure there's a scratch or two on it somewhere on this side. I just am not seeing it right now. If, it, if there is, it's minor because there's just nothing jumping out at me. This is really, really good. Backside of it looks great. Really nice chrome bumper. Love that look. Toyota managed to modernize their look a little bit, but still keep that classic feel to it that Toyota's always clung to because it's like, hey, you can be all techy and all, all this high tech stuff that breaks, or you can make a really cool vehicle that lasts forever and still has a decent look to it. And that's what Toyota does. Look at this bed cover, um, the bed liner. It's just perfect back here. Uh, if I was buying a bed cover, the old Toyota ones I was not a fan of. This is a Toyota brand one. They nailed this because it's low profile and it's not gonna fade like the other one did. It's just got a nice texture to it. And uh, it just, it's just the easiest little tri-fold ever. Obviously you just release the tension, pick up, fold it. So try not to oversell it, but I've already told you I'm a Toyota fan. So this just gets me excited. All right, passenger side. If you don't buy it, I will. Uh, passenger side looks great. Love it. And we can do an underneath on this pretty easy because it's so big. Great. nice and clean of course we do an under spray on all of our vehicles whether it's a whether it's a 2022 camry or an older truck it's not going to matter we do that under spray kind of seals it up makes them look good uh protects it moving forward a little bit uh but rust is rust and corrosion is corrosion so if it was under there we would see it and there's just nothing really to point out yeah so tundras this is they're the king of space right and they, they've kept that They've kept that for the new body style. All kinds of space back here. I mean, the storage right there is just unbelievable. Um, they did do, instead of the, the flat, uh, they did make a compartment down here. I like it. I think they nailed it. There's your cleat tie downs, which is always great to see. Little accessory kit over there. Um, really nice Toyota floor mats. Yep, just awesome. And I like the... I don't know why, but when I noticed that for the first time, I liked that. It just, it just kind of has a cool look on the inside. Just a little accent. All right. Kick plate looks good. It's got my footprint there, of course. Um, driver's seat's in great shape. Nice texture on the edges of it. All right, now you're going to hear me grunt as I jump up in here. All right, so you got your display here, of course. All your steering wheel controls. I mean, that is really clean, really nice. And they, they made the, the traveling on that really, really easy. Uh, let's see, you got a heated steering wheel. 
Uh, you got auto dimming headlights. Of course, your uh, light for the bed. The auto off feature that you just click that button and you don't have to mess with that. Um, drive mode, different drive modes. I think there's an eco, a sport, and a normal. There's your four-wheel drive controls. You've got two key fobs and really nice floor mats. A lot of our trucks come with one key and no floor mats. Uh, so I love this. It's got both, both key fobs and um, really nice floor mats. Love the center console. Love, I mean, you're going to hear this repetitive theme, but I, I love the way they've designed this. So you've got this, and this is a little compartment. You can actually take that divider out if you want, if you just want more space. But so you've got your... Uh, kind of like quick access there, but it lifts up. There's a button on both sides that will lift this up. And then you can see just how massive all the space is there. Several layers. Everything's clean. This truck smells good. Doesn't smell like smoke or animal or anything like that. Owner's manuals, all that good stuff. The vents are really stylish, really cool. They kind of got that bulky, boxy look to them. And uh, yet somehow, like I said, with Toyota, still modern. So they got rid of the big round knobs up here. They did they did get rid of that and kind of made this more sleek. Uh, but you've got your little, little toggle switches here. Um, trying to think what else. You got your TRD badging, a couple different spots in the truck. Just great. So with that, coolest Toyota feature ever is that backsliding glass that goes all the way down. been a staple for a long time kind of become an iconic thing for them jealous of that for sure and last but not least we'll look underneath the hood super clean really good size engine and uh, obviously the twin turbo components takes it to another level Plenty of torque, plenty of power, and yet they've gotten more gas mileage into the Tundra, which was greatly needed. Uh, very, very, very pleased with this thing all the way through. Top to bottom, front to back, inside and out. So, the mileage is low enough on this, even though it's got the wheels and the tires and the lift and all that. A lot of times that will void the factory warranty that comes from Toyota. Well, that's the beauty of this is that we can, because it has 28,000 miles on it, we can sell a factory type total care warranty that protects this truck all the way out to 120,000 miles. So the key is get payment options with and without that and let you decide how you want to do it. But uh, no brainer for me, covers the technology, covers the engine, covers the transmission, even with the lift wheel and tire package on it. Parking sensors, all that good stuff's covered as well. So. Let me know what else I can do to help.